In this biodemographic short, I consider relative age. I'll start with a humorous quote. My late friend Stan Ullum used to remark that his life was sharply divided into two halves. In the first half, he was always the youngest person in the group. In the second half, he was always the oldest. There was no transition period. This is from MIT mathematician Giancarlo Rota. Consider this graphic with calendar age on the x-axis, defined as the number of years since a person is born, and relative age on the y-axis, defined as the percentage of people in the world whose calendar age is less than that person. This also represents a person's percentile in the world population age structure. Using the data plotted in this figure, note that when a woman born in 1950 is age 10, she is older than a quarter of the people on the planet. When the same woman is only age 20, she is older than half of the people in the world. And at age 30, she is older than nearly two-thirds of the world's population. After age 60, her relative age is in the 90 percentiles, which suggests that, relatively speaking, she ages more slowly. Note that this figure shows that the relative age of a person born in the year 2000 advances less rapidly relative to his or her calendar age than someone born in 1950.